In this video, we will create the pull-through transition in Wondershare Filmora. First, place your main footage on track 1. Then, add your green screen footage where you're holding a green square paper in your hand. Next, navigate to the video editing options and find the AI tools. Use the chroma key feature to remove the green color from the footage. Adjust the tolerance and edge feather settings as needed. Afterwards, drop your main footage again on track 3. Split it at the point where you want the transition to end and delete the remaining portion. Now proceed to the Smart Cutout feature and isolate the hand only. Click on Start and make any necessary manual selections and corrections. Take your time to ensure a perfect selection of the hand. If another person's hand appears, include it in the selection but avoid selecting any other body parts. Once you're satisfied with the result, click on Save. Next, locate the part in the timeline where the girl is pulling the person. Go to the Effects section and find the Exposure keyframe option. After 7 frames, change the exposure to 68. Then set the exposure to 0 one frame before the end. Repeat the same process for the main footage on track 1 by creating exposure keyframes at the same locations. Put the playhead at 1 second and 20th frame. Select the footage on track 2. Go to the video editing options and find the transform keyframe feature. After 17 frames, increase the scale of the footage to take the green screen out of the frame. To create a zoom effect, navigate to the effects section. Look for the Boris FX category and select the blur option. Apply the BCC radial blur effect to the footage on track 2. Adjust the effect settings by setting the maximum deviation to 115 and the spin angle to 0. Now place the playhead again at 1 second and 20th frame. Turn on zoom amount keyframe. After 2 frames, set the zoom amount to 32. Once the transition is complete, set the zoom amount back to 0. Feel free to adjust the zoom amount according to your desired effect. To enhance the color, apply the Auto Enhance effect to the footage on track 4. Then apply the Sharpen effect to further enhance the overall appearance. Now let's render it to see the final preview. If you're interested in more creative editing, check out filmora.wondershare.com.